Hi everyone, it's your boy Zach, and I just finished reading Batman 87. I don't know if you can tell, it's getting a little dark. I usually darker than I would do a video, but I can't wait. I can't wait. I got to do this right now. This is the second issue of James the IV, uh, his run on Batman. I got to say, oh my gosh, it's so freaking good. Now, I've read a couple of his things before. They're always solid, but they seemed a little restrained. I'm not a huge MMA fan, but I did, you know, watch the Cowboy Cerrone, as you're supposed to say, Cerrone fight with Conor McGregor. And what was so amazing about it is that he was fighting while defending. He gets tackled, he's kneeing you in the head, and then when you move your head away from getting kneed, he's beating you up with his freaking shoulder. Like, you're on defense, you're being tackled and pushed across the freaking ring, and you're winning. Like, this is like, I don't want to call it dense because that sounds like it takes a long time to read it. I read it very quickly. It's packed. Like, everything is packed. So, uh, we got a classic, Heroes in Peril. Who's this? Who's this? Tell me what the deal. Then, you know, we start off, we get uh, uh, the Riddler acting crazy, and then we got this, uh, I laughed out loud at this joke. Okay, spoiler, go go buy it. Spoiler, go buy it. Okay, you're bu you, you bought it, you read it, you're back. Okay. So, you know, uh, Riddler's being kind of crazy, calling uh, <laughs> Penguin, and then Penguin goes, you know, he's, he's killing somebody, he goes, I do not appreciate this intrusion. This is a private line and I'm working. <laughs> so they're getting ca all caught up. Batman's just captured a whole bunch of bad guys. Uh, so they're kind of cleaning house on anyone that can rat them out. You know, the penguins killed like his whole inner circle. Uh, skip a couple pages for the copyright gods. And jeez, uh, even Catwoman. Cat, bat, cat, bat. No, she's not annoying either. We got a, a Bullock as um uh oh this fantastic art by uh guillem march guillem march uh guillem march as i say it in my head now if you look at this you might be thinking is that one of the cuberts and there is a definitely like a in the like the posing specifically but um uh so uh bullock is the commissioner they're dealing with all the shenanigans um uh, uh batman has been inspired by alfred's death to be more you know thoughtful and proactive not in crime so much but it's like he wants to rebuild large parts of the city so he's calling himself like the designer he's designed this awesome uh jail for uh, the new gcpd headquarters um and the uh all these assassins are caught there so there's a great interrogation scene i love this part where uh look how awesome and intimidating batman is can you imagine this guy saying like bat cat like she even tried that he'd be like hold a finger up he's like i'm working um so uh you know this is deathstroke who's you know he's chad so he's not worried about this and there's a great part where he's like uh batman says like what makes you think i can't dismantle your bank accounts and then deathstroke says what makes you think they're paying me cash i was like damn there were also a lot of other like damn moments or like ooh, that's good so uh then we get into the whole uh, uh we get this awesome design for this new uh bat vehicle and then he's got this like uh i don't know what you call this a sled let's just call it a sled it's kind of a sled okay so uh the sled that pops out of it does anyone remember the 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 gi joe whale it was their hovercraft and uh at the front it had this little like a sled that would pop out of the front. It made me think about that. It makes me think that James Tinney and the fourth might have had that. So look how cool the design is. I always liked uh, Guillaume March's stuff, um, but it's like, it's so much better. Look at this woman, she's absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Uh, this is all I can show, because uh, the, the, the rest is gonna be on, you know, showing like more than half the book. But uh, anyway. <laughs> I can all you can always tell how good a book is by how short the video is. Five minutes and a few seconds. I had to edit out. I started editing my videos a little. Just when I like trip over my own words or say something that doesn't make any sense, I'll edit it out. Progress. Um, you can tell how good this is by how short the video is. I'm done. That's it. Definitely recommend. Definitely go get it. I hope you bought it and then like 
the video and then he came back. So uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Make sure you're still subscribed. Hit the bell for notifications. Thanks to everyone giving to the GoFundMe and the Indiegogo. You're funding original content and an original lawsuit. Links are in the description, and I'll have more new and old comic book videos up soon. Thanks. Bye.